hey guys welcome to the channel and thank you for watching another defeat in the usa this time it was live from charlotte north carolina chelsea won real madrid two that means three defeat one draw and one win for the usa 2 2024 last season we won pretty much every single game. We just drew one game against the uh, Russia Dortmund. Is that means that we're gonna get smashed during the season? Probably not, because this is just preseason. But it's really, really worrying. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment down below if you wanna help your brother out. And I wanted to say thank you so much for everybody that was there for my live stream call in show it was an amazing show so many people showed up and we watched the game together and it was really fun it was like uh, almost five hours of show just in case you ask me we don't see your face where are you at hey i'm on television every single day <laughs> i'm on youtube i do watch alongs i do call in show like tomorrow i don't even know what what the day is in your country now but on wednesday we have a, a big show to talk about transfer news omoro dion kano galaga and so many other topics and what we need and we're gonna have also talk about where we go from here because it doesn't look like uh, like everything is working for us at the moment so we have to start preparing for the season and see what happens so be there tomorrow foot state link in the description down below that is the channel that we do live watch along call in show every single day anyways my people it's uh, getting too late here in kentucky so we're gonna go very quickly because i am tired <laughs> after five hours of live stream real madrid lucas vasquez 19th minute and brahim diaz 27th minute we resisted a little bit at the beginning and i was like yeah this time around we didn't concede two goals in five minutes and then i jinx it 19th minute we conceded a stupid goal literally a typing if Thiago Silva was in that defense, that is not a goal. 100% not a goal at all. The second goal also is just like a comedy of mistakes. Lack of pace. The defense is not organized. We got caught in transition. It's something very, very wrong in the defense, in the midfield. There is no coordination at all. And for Chelsea Football Club, it was Noni Madueke. 39th minute header from nowhere really uh, i i didn't really believe that noni madweke can get in the middle of defenders and score uh score a header enzo fernandez with that cross very very good cross to be honest just like fabrigas so we lost the second half was kind of very quiet we made changes real madrid made changes so it was like okay let's keep the fitness level good and don't get injured kind of second half so the positive from this one is we didn't we don't have injuries don't have injuries we're going back to london without blaming american pitches because nicholas jackson got injured in senegal kdh got injured at cobham everybody that wasn't fit uh, had a knock everything came from from England. So you're not gonna blame American pitches this time around. So for Chelsea Football Club, look at the, our lineup. It was uh, Jorgensen who played 90 minutes. I'm very happy because I wanted to see him for 90 minutes. If you're gonna prepare him to start the season and then it's time to give him time, 90 minutes to get used to. Badiashile, Corwell, Rhys James, Malu Gusto from the wrong position one more time. 
Enzo Fernandez, Lavia, Madueke, Nkunku, Sterling. If you go to Real Madrid, you see that they have more experience, more quality. Did I say Giyu? Giyu was, yeah, Nkunku, Sterling, Giyu. Probably I forgot to, to name Giyu here. You got me. It's too late in Kentucky. Bad time, man. Anyways, for them, Thibaut Courtois, the snake, somebody who betrayed Chelsea Football Club, Lucas Vasquez, Militao, Rudiger, one of us, Garcia, Martin, Modric, Ceballos, Diaz, Vinicius Jr., Rodrigo. So in terms of experience, in terms of know-how, Real Madrid, way, way better than Chelsea Football Club. This Real Madrid team can even win the Champions League. We are nowhere to be seen. We are like three weeks old under the new manager. New system. People don't understand each other. I'm not trying to find excuses for Mareska, but I am stating fact. It's up to you to take it or leave it. They are fact. They are not excuses. Hear me? And from the bench, Mikalo Mudrik, man, he need a loan. That brother is getting just worse. Somebody said that he, he was a Ballon d'Or material. Remember the Zerbi? He said that he was going to win the Ballon d'Or. When he's going to win that? Uh, KDH also came for in the second half. Moises Caicedo was there in the second half. Wesley Fofana. And we had a lot of unused bench today. I don't know why Renato Vega, Vega is not playing. Josh Hanshipong, Tariq. I don't know, man. I don't know what uh, the manager is trying to do, but this kind of managers like Pep Guardiola, they use like 11, 12 players for almost the entire season and the rest need to be frustrated on a bench. I don't know. I don't want to judge him too much. I have to wait until the end season starts, but it doesn't look good, man. It doesn't look good. Let's go to some statistics here very quick. Good statistics. Shot nine for Real Madrid. Oh, nine for Chelsea. Fourteen for Real Madrid. Shot on target. Chelsea three. Real Madrid three. Possession. Real fifty-seven. Chelsea forty-three. Oh, this means nothing. The end of the day. End of the day, you just need to win your game and all these stupid statistics. Nothing. So the the, the preseason in America is a, f a big failure. Just like Mareska said, they didn't even train. They just went from one event to another one. They didn't even have time. They trained for two weeks at Cobham. And when he, they go back home, they're going to train for I don't know how many days. So let's hope that everything works for us. But I don't know, man. I'm, I'm a little bit worried, but I'm going to stay positive.